another indeed stunning part of the current MDMA trial is that we have had not a single bad side effect. That's because it's such a carefully done study. You know, because you're studying it yourself. It's a real pain in the ass study because you know, we do so much to make sure that people are okay. It's such a very careful creation of a cocoon for people to have these very, very profound experiences. Many of them are quite painful, actually. So, Basil, you said that you were advising um, the design of the MAPS trial to not include people with developmental traumas or people that had had these complex presentations. And you're right. glad they didn't listen because Boy, glad. those were the people yeah. that did very well, and particularly um, people in the dissociative subtype did well. So um, even though you got that wrong, who, what would you say sitting but here that, today about you know it? It's like, <laughs> it would be wrong. What's fascinating about our study is that we had no adverse side effects, which really surprised me. The research through MAPS that we're doing, um, we have had no side effects. Yeah. Uh, like, really, like, yeah, no, these are powerful really? drugs. People wow. have very, very yeah. painful lives, horrible lives. Every single subject that we saw had a remarkable experience of going very deeply inside. Uh, and this is no picnic. This is not an experience like, oh, we see God and we see great transcendent realities and we feel so much better. People actually go into their trauma and they lie there and they suffer as they go into it. But What are your concerns about somebody taking this drug at home? And hopefully you have a sitter with you who is very kind. I just want to, before we leave it out, don't do the experiences outside of a therapeutic environment. Don't have people blow their minds in their homes by themselves. These are potentially very dangerous substances because stuff comes up. And it's very important to create a place where people feel held and people may be yelling and screaming as stuff comes up and you need to be there for them and say, it's okay. 